Oh, Zian, we're back. There we go. Hey, we're back. Hi. In case you missed it, we didn't realize we had gone off stream. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure how that happened or why. Thursday and Friday, we will not be streaming because we will be at San Japan in San Antonio, Texas. Down in San Antonio, Texas for the convention. And uh, Wednesday, we're going to be doing a double-length charity stream. Yes, we uh, want to help out the... Uh, all of the fine people here in the great state of Texas that were hit in Houston, Corpus Christi, that whole area yeah. by Hurricane Harvey. So we're going to be doing a uh, charity stream where we throw up a donation button, just try to do a big old drive to get some money down there to help them out. Uh, we just want to help out all those yes. people that were hit by that hurricane. It seems really shitty. I mean, we know people in Houston. Yeah, definitely. And it would be great to be able to throw a helping hand their way with the with the means we have available. Yeah, more information on that as it comes up, but yes. that's what we'll be doing on Wednesday. It'll be double length starting at 4 o'clock central rather than 6 o'clock central. And meanwhile, Grant, uh, I'm going to help you get some of these easier to get power cells. Yes, since I am a new jacker, we decided to have an go. old pro jacker. You got to chase those birds and then they cause an avalanche. Ah. I, I don't know how you missed the hint. Well, I mean, it's obvious. Birds, avalanches. Birds, rock synonymous. slide. It seems like they go hand to hand. Peanut butter and motor oil. Like, should have just been the right avalanche. there, tip of my tongue. Let's check it out. Yeah, don't don't worry about it. I know. Uh, like, see, I've been jacking since I was twelve. So ah, okay. Like in my in my formative years. A bit more experience than yes, me. Yes, I spent a lot of time jacking. You you started like a few weeks ago. It's yeah. Okay. I'm just really glad that the whole internet came together to tell me how good of a job I was doing. And was just very positive and over the top compliments left and right. Really, uh, really good for that old self esteem. It is nice of them. Yeah. Honestly. Thank you. The whole community just kind of comes together when it comes to somebody who's new to a game who may not <laughs> yeah. quite know exactly it's what just, they're doing. I, but it's the patience, really, mm -hmm. that everybody has that I just am so appreciative for. Uh, also, I saw a couple people asking. Kieran should be joining us at some point. He had an appointment today. Yeah, he has a so, doctor's appointment that he's but at. He'll be heading here after that's now, done. Let's take a quick look at what we have here. Oh, good. We got all of them. Now we can head back to the place that everybody wants us to go, the Misty Islands. <gasps> the Misty Islands? Seemed like a neat area. I'll look forward to it. It is. And I know there's a few that we missed in the jungle. Uh, not a lot, but just like one or two. We'll be heading back and just doing some in spaces that uh, we ha we have seen in episodes that we have done so far. Yes. I believe we just got to the volcano today in the yes. most recent episodes. I think that's where we showed up. All right, then I will the not show off any of the areas crater. around there. Because frankly, all the power cells that we missed there are pretty easy. Actually, funny enough, since this just came out on PS4 as well, mm -hmm. uh, I went I went through and I just bought it for fun to play it myself. Beat it over the weekend. Nice. Just, just had a good time. It's good to see that it still holds up all these years. It does. It's honestly still my favorite platformer. This and Ratchet and Clank like really did a good job. My I, brother I just really like loved the Ratchet and Clank better. series. That's another franchise that like I poked my head in a little bit and never really, I never finished any of the games. Russian Renegade dropping, I believe that's 500 bits. What's he have to Ooh. say, HBI? <laughs> he is pulling it up. Yeah, I'm, I'm still starting everything up. It's Monday, guys. Woo, Monday. Uh, hey, sometimes my mic is turned on and sometimes it's not. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey, uh, Rushing Renegade with the 500 bits says, uh, shout out to the time at San Japan 2014 when Taka was called the Vic Manana of the abridging community. Oh, oh man. A name he wore proudly. Some San Japan memories right there. Oh. Oh. It's good to see that sometimes Jack doesn't do what you want to do either. Yeah. I know some people were probably telling you about this. Apparently. I don't like backseat gaming that much. I mean, it's probably not apparent when we're actually in the middle of it. I was going to say, it's one of those things where, like, the audience doesn't realize, and like and I, I hold back. I was gonna say I, I'm saying this as someone who also can frequently backseat game. Uh, it's you don't realize how much you're holding back when you feel like you know everything. Let's go. Oh, there we go. Let's see, we got one right over there. Look at that. 
Oh, wow. We never even went for flies here, did we? Nope. All I wanted was that muse, and then I left. Eh, eh, eh. Now, let's see. I need to break this first. Oh, fall. Damn it. Make me use this. I'm going to wait for it to come back. It'll be easier that way. Yeah. There we go. Makes sense. Up. 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 Ah, out of the way, prick. Woo! I have more than enough time. There we go. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> Precision platforming. You got it. Next Graham dropping 500 bits. Missed the message. And Nightblade with another 500 bits. Thank you guys so Thank much. Thank you very much. Once Ben is done with his rundown of whatchamajiggering that he's doing, I'm sure he'll catch us up. Yep, yep. Let's see. We had uh, Noxgarm asking, Hey, Grant, did you get the beta code for Dissidia Final Fantasy on Twitter? Uh, I'll have to check. I don't... I, I'm. Ouch, if, if you sent it, I should definitely have it, but I have not looked at Twitter much today. Thank you, though. Yeah, that sounds awesome. I've never Get played any of those games, so I'm curious to mess with it. Whoop All right, this part, I'm probably not going to win the first time. He's so modest, you guys. I am. I'm incredibly modest. Let's see. Ah, yeah, man, this ain't no bacon tree. It's a ham bush. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah you see it. what I, I did there? I get it. Oh. Woo! Let's see. Eventually, they'll start throwing stronger lurkers at me. Ah, ah you were so close to getting so close the extra, to that extra health. health. I thought I was going to hit him with it. I, every time that happens, I just think, Dexter, you're surrounded by lurkers. <laughs> yeah, come on, man. They're going to get over there. They're going to, like, fish ho fush, like fish hook your mouth and just, like, rip you apart. Hardison009 asking, Grant, have you heard about the return of Brock and Misty in the Sun and Moon anime? I did see that. Like, as much as I love Pokemon, I, like, Brock and Misty don't exactly have, like, huge personalities. So it's not like a, you know what? They definitely needed to come back. It's just like, I guess that's cool. You don't need the red eco because all the camera. All right, because all the uh, purple dudes die in one hit anyway. Ah. All right, let's see. Do I got a? Yeah, I got a trail. All right. Let's slow and steady. Whip. Uh, ha! I thought you'd get me, but you didn't. Whoop. Whoop. See, swing in. He's gonna be annoying. I'm seeing seeing lots of people asking, hey, I just got here, what's up with Wednesday? There there are lots of details that we still have to figure out because we, we will be doing a charity stream for yep. the uh, Hurricane Harvey relief on Wednesday. Yes. Yes. The the exact specifics such as which charity it'll <laughs> benefit, we're still still deciding. Yeah. Since the hurricane hit hard and fast, we didn't exactly have a lot of time to <laughs> yeah. put this together, but we thought, you know, better while it's fresh. Yep. So we want to yeah, want to get them do, do something to help. Yeah, got to want to try and get them that help while they still need it. So Speaking of, I saw Floral Vi uh, Viking, I believe, just give us 500 bits. They said they are trapped in their Houston area home oh, from floodwaters. Oh, so geez. Well, that sounds terrifying. Yeah. I'm glad you still have power. Yeah, That's if, nice. Yeah, we do have a, an exclamation Harvey command in the chat with a, a link to several good charities if you don't want to wait. Like, by all means, yeah, don't absolutely. wait to if help you, out those you, people. If you, if you yeah. don't want to wait or if you can't make it, yeah. donate but, now if you have the means to. Yeah, we. a lot of people have been asking, like, are we okay? Yeah, we are hundreds of miles yes, away yes. from the hurricane. Not, not even close yeah. to where the hurricane was, like, really doing damage. Yeah, Texas the, is a very big place. Yeah. <laughs> at, at worst, I think we'll be getting some rain over the next few days. Yeah. yeah that, and that's if it, like, if the winds don't change. Yeah, that said, we have, lots of us have friends in in that area. Mm -hmm. Stefan Krosex, who does a bunch of work for us, he is in Houston. Seems like he's been okay so far. I think his power yeah, internet went yeah, out I was gonna for say, like I think he, I think he's half a day. Power. Our friend Chelsea is down there. Yeah. yeah. So so yeah, we 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 definitely have friends. Yeah, like we directly uh, are in no danger. We're fine, but we definitely want to help out down those there, people. I yeah. Oh wow. All right. 
I'm not entirely familiar with the Misty Island. I didn't 100% this place, even in my, like, weekend playthrough. Mm. So I'm actually still just kind of exploring here. Hmm, I bet shooting those guys is going to be a thing. Up. Oh, up. Whoop. Nope, oh, Sam, we're back. And least, we're back, cool. I at least I saw someone say that. All right, yeah. All right. People are confirming. Welcome back. Don't know what's been up. Having some slight twitchy problems. Who knows? But trust us, we are doing everything on our end to make sure they don't happen again. Yeah, I'm not sure if it, like, our, our internet's doing fine. We, like, I tested it, like, even just before we streamed, mm -hmm. so. Probably on server side. Boom. Bing. You know, Green Sage, really be a dick. You know that? I am doing nothing but helping. Not everybody here is Daxter. Wipe that ridiculous grin off your face, Daxter. The two of you have plenty to do. Get on with it. I feel like this guy is just a bad attitude. He's a, he's a curmudgeon. Is he our village, like, elder or something? Yeah. Like, he's supposed to be our respected guy? And Jack's just being like, you know, dude, I'm going to bang your daughter, so shut up. <laughs> Maybe Bless that's you. why he's in such a cross mood. He knows that Kira's coming coming of age and Jack and Dax yeah. are the only men of age in town. <laughs> at least at least Daxter's a fucking ferret now though, so <laughs> that's at least one less dick you gotta worry about. Speaking of Kira, I watched the Death Note Netflix movie over the weekend. Oh boy, how was that? I actually Apparently, me, Kieran, and Little Karibo like that movie more than everyone else. More than 99.99% yes. of the internet. Because, like, I thought, like, no, it is not a great retelling of Death Note, the manga, and anime. But I think it is a, as far as reimaginings go, I think it's fine. Like, it's very different. But I think that's by design, and I don't think it, I don't think it being different is a problem. The part I think stopped me from, like, watching it was... <laughs> You see, I call it Kira because that in Japanese it means killer. Yeah. Ah, that's... so if they look for you, it'll be on a different continent. Uh huh. To be fair, that, to be fair, there's a little, out. there's a little bit more context to that line because he does say Kira is apparently Russian for light or so something or some something. I don't know. It's apparently... But he spells it like moon. Yeah, like it's some weird ass thing. Uh, but yeah, like I'm not gonna say everything's great. There are certainly dumb sequences, such as that one. Uh, but What's I thought your favorite thing, the bike. Of course, classic. Notice how the controls are great and work They're just fantastic. as expected. Get away, you. Gotcha. <laughs> but like, there were plenty of shots that I like. I think the film was shot very well. Like, I thought like all of the like like visually everything looks really good. Uh, there are all these sequences with Ryuk like out of focus in the background while stuff is happening, so and it's, it's visual, really so it's visually interesting. Yes, and and I think those are like really well done. See, uh, that's more important to me in in a lot of cases. Yeah, than a movie like this, I might actually end up watching it. Like I think I think the actor they got for Light kind of sucks, but was I, it not Zac Efron? I kept it, it was it not Zac Efron. Efron. Uh, it did not end up being him. But I think in a weird way that's kind of by design because I think they want you to not like light because he is like written as a shitty dude and which is very different from the anime which i think made a lot of people not like it right but like i think it was on purpose they were like this is not going to be cool smart has everything together light this is a shitty dumpy teenager who got this superpower and we're going to see how he'd use it okay so it is just like a full-on reimagining yes and that you know, that's good. Better than like I, I'm I, better than a. And I was fine with that decision. Like I can understand why people who were like, no, the key to Death Note is how it's like this brilliant guy fell apart. Like I can get that, and if that's what you're looking for, then watch no. the show. Yeah, exactly. That's what the anime and three Japanese live action movies are for, where they tell you that. <laughs> you know, they give you that story. Guys, you know what I like to watch? What, what do, do you like? To like? Watch? Big bit drops. Whoa! Like from, oh, I love big bit drops. I like, cannot lie. Like the 1500 bits from Lethal Titan saying, loving you guys, playing my favorite game of all time. This is a great game. Yep. 
And then 5,000 bits from Takeshi saying, it's a fine movie, weird music choices, I think, though, especially that Ferris wheel scene. That scene Thank you, beat was Takeshi. Really I weird. loved you in Battle Royal. <laughs> and holy shit, 5,000 bits? God yes, damn. Thank you very yeah. much. There's another one hidden around here somewhere. Can't remember what I have to do for it. It might have been just kill all those mine dudes. Which I'd feel kind of silly because I just left one alive. It might have been. Yeah, seeing people say kill the last flying lurker. Yeah, alright. Alright, let's let's take him down. Take him down at peg. There he is. Hey, what's up? Got him. Oh. Sort of. I don't know. That might have oh. respawned him. No, oh, never mind. He's got the, the mine. mine. Come on. Come here. Gotcha. <laughs> oh, there must be another one. Maybe it was just people saying they wanted you to do that. Maybe it didn't actually have any effect on anything. Maybe I left one alive. Like, there was uh, floating up somewhere. Like, when I was, uh, you know, when I was about to do that barrel jumping puzzle. That shit. I don't need all these. Oh, that one. Yeah, ah. there he is. I missed him. Get some yellow eco and shoot him. Uh, there's only red and blue here. Unfortunately. Stingy old Misty Mountain, or Misty uh, Island. Far over the Misty Island's cold. I don't know if I saw all the Hobbit movies. I'm there is a certain cut out there called the Tolkien cut where they um, get rid of cut all out all like Peter the love Jackson's triangle edition. shit. Like anything that they needed to make it three movies, they yeah. cut that part. Yeah, I watched that cut. It's still not good that way. Oh, <laughs> it's really? just it's shorter. Better. I mean, I'm sure it is. I watched the the full version of the first one, and it was. Did you go down to the ground. Is that close enough to the? It is. Damn it. <laughs> it felt like when, you know when there's a video game that I was see. developed over like oh, five years and clearly had a lot of heart and soul on, put into it? Go. Right. And then they rush out a sequel within a year. It <laughs> felt like that rushed sequel. Ooh. Yeah. Like, like maybe a little more polished than the last one because they had the last one to work off of as a basis, but the soul is just gone. Gotcha. <laughs> I like how he just popped out of it and just floats <laughs> away. Hey! I guess he was weighing it down. Ooh, Ronan of Death dropping uh, uh, 1160 bits. What's he have to say? Uh, he says, I've uh, been saving these bits for a long time. Just to let you know, it's going to be my birthday Friday. However, oh! I'm flying down to San Japan on Thursday, so I'm dropping it now. Oh! Shit! Good. We're looking forward to seeing you, Ronan, but... If it is your birthday today, if it is your birthday tomorrow, if it is your birthday this week, at some point in time, happy freaking birthday to you. Zeno, come over here and do a dance. Happy birthday. Zeno doing the birthday dance for you. Holy crap. You've been around the sun I don't know how many times now. Because it's however many times it is that you are old, and I don't know how old you are. But God damn it. Happy birthday. No, no, Z Song's Z Z over, Z Zito! Zito! Nope. What's up? <sighs> One uh, of these days we'll figure that out. Get the timing. How's it going, Zito? You got a new pewter? Just so, so you can do stuff from home more? Just more, more strems? Well, the fact that... Oh, yes. Well, the fact that my computer that I have currently at home that's not set up... That is a decade old with only two upgrades on it. Oh. oh. Poop. Sounds like my home rig. All right, just the flies left. But I don't feel like hunting boxes. <laughs> Sounds like me at the club every weekend. <laughs> <laughs> I leave single. <laughs> uh, hunting boxes. Zito looks so proud of himself. <laughs> I wasn't proud of the birthday dance. It wasn't even a dance. I like someone said in the chat that I should it's have a, a pencil uh, for that it's dance. It's a kooky so walk, if that. anything. I should get like an organ grinder. <laughs> <laughs> it's Houdini, the magical dancing boy. 
<laughs> Zito, do you have any nostalgia or experience with the Jack and Daxter franchise? I remember playing the demo. All right. Uh, I got the demo disc off the PlayStation magazine. Yeah. Uh, and unfortunately, I was too much of a bab with no allowance that I could. I a I didn't own a PlayStation One ever. This I is a PlayStation Two. Oh, PlayStation Two. All right, then that makes sense why I played it because I was like, wait a minute. I That's one that everybody had. I like don't remember owning a PlayStation One ever. That was the one system I never got. Uh, don't need it if you got the PS2. Yeah. Yep. Well, oh, I remember why I got the PS2. The PS2 was because my grandma won it at Atlantic City during the time where there was a scarce of it. Oh, wow. Hmm. Yes, and she had, she was about to sell it, and I'm like, no! Grandma, please! No! She's like, what do I do with this? Would you want it? Yes! Please! <laughs> I need it! Do owning a PlayStation apart from a PS4 has always had this weird little story to it because it, the grandma story with the PS2, my PS3, my uncle, uh, who was a cop, uh, I was waiting for who works at Nintendo. No, no, no. He was a cop. He, <laughs> a cop he, who he, works at Nintendo. A cop who, yeah, the bouncer that works at Nintendo. He was a, uh, he, uh, there was a, there was a cocaine bust, and one of the things nice. they used to smuggle out cocaine with was the PS3. They refurbished it and gave it to me. <laughs> That's hysterical. <laughs> Your PS3 is all coked up, man. It's hyper powered. Uh, how many were left here? Just two. Oh, that's easy. Looks like I'm seeing, was it 14 or 1500 from Tortilla Lady? Yeah, Bits so dropped. I've actually got a bug out for a meeting in a couple minutes, but ah. bit rundown before I go. We've got 500 from Verdbj16 saying thank you, Team Four Star. Thank You're you, Verdbj, for having a hard name to pronounce. Nice. Thank you, Verdbj. And, and Tortilla Lady with 1400 bits saying, hello all. Do y'all like Starbucks? Oh, I and another thousand just now like from the Starbucks. Dark One. I like coffee. Thank you, Dark One. Oh, jeez. Like now they're coming in. <laughs> I meant to just go down them rapid fire, and now they're coming in again. The Dark One with a thousand saying, just subscribe. You guys have been great. Keep it up. Thank nice. you. Nice. Thank you for the subscri it. subscription. And Number Hunter with a thousand yep. bits. Zito, do you, have you ever sniffed your PS3? No. No, I have not. Have you ever cut it and, like, you, 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 have to, you have to cut it with a little bit of talcum first. <laughs> <laughs> And I'm gonna flip Dollar this bill. monitor around. I was gonna say, yeah, out. if you could flip that monitor no, over. To cut. Oh, no, right, you're right, to cut. Yeah, right. yeah to cut with something means to, like, add to it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hello, hello. Hopefully, I'm Trust still me. coming in on My this My mom mic. was big on the Coke. That was, like, a big, that was a big thing in the 80s. Yeah, it was. Coke? Yes. Still talking yeah, about cocaine. Like, cocaine and both, both of my parents were in radio, so... Ah. Funny enough, my mom actually met because she was my dad's dealer. Nice. Wow. Yeah. See, these are the stories you don't hear about drug use is how they bring families together. Yeah. <laughs> you never hear that story. Yeah, those are the stories that that Dare just won't tell you. <laughs> because Dare is a shitty fucking organization? Apparently. Yeah, kind they, of. They, they do more harm than they do good. They kind of aggravate the uh the the want of drugs more than they do like prevent it and i i don't mean to be mean-spirited because i know there are some people in that organization that try to do good but unfortunately the way they go about it is so in your face that it makes people want to do i'm drugs. fairly sure in high school the people who i knew used drugs the most were the kids in dare t-shirts dude that that's the best because have you ever seen the episode of south park where they're actually talking about that where it's like the dare quote uh the dare like parody was like them talking, was called Butt Out, and they were teaching them not to smoke. And then, of course, mm -hmm. they start smoking in the back of the fucking school. Yeah. Because it was just like, if you don't want to be, if you don't, if you, if you don't smoke, you could become cool just like us. And then there's them inhaling like three packs. Yeah. By the way, for everybody asking, no, I wasn't, I'm not quite a Coke baby. I may have, I may have been, uh, <laughs> I was not conceived because of Coke anyway. My, uh, I came out about a decade into that relationship. After they'd grown up and moved on to the harder stuff, yeah, like they, 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 had, they had quit by the time I was done. That being said, when I was out, they went back to it a little bit. But once in a blue moon, response <laughs> too Res responsibly, please. Responsibly. <laughs> oh lord. Uh, uh, JG Team Ruby throws us five bits, saying, Yo. Uh, "Since you're doing Jack and Daxter, can we expect Ratchet and Clank in the future?" I don't think there are any concrete plans for it, but nothing else. No says concrete we won't. plans, but it's certainly a franchise we enjoy. 
has a lot of ups and has a lot of downs, but most of the time it's just really competent games. Like, in the in the best way possible. I mean, I, I like the universe. I like I like the writing. I like the characters. I mean, fuck me. The, that game is nothing but good characters, but... Yeah, Jack and Daxter's, like... Jack and Daxter's characters and story gets better as it go along. Uh, Ratchet and Clank doesn't seem to evolve much. It doesn't evolve, but it makes it feel like it, it, then it makes it feel like it's more of a serialized cartoon in that sense. Yes, and that's fine. A lot of butt puns. Yes. <laughs> that's all I remember from it. Like I think story-wise, Jack and da story-wise Jack and Daxter definitely gets better as it goes along because that's Naughty Dog evolving into what they would Learning eventually become with stories. their narrative with their narrative movie-like games. Imagine if there was a game where the Jack and the Daxter fought the Ratchet and the Clanks. Ooh, that would be one heck J of a J&D versus R and C. Yeah, that would be one heck of a lethal showdown. Except that no one dies; they just come back, and there's no consequence for getting weren't, knocked out of the stage. Weren't they together in that game, like the PlayStation Heroes or yeah, whatever? Yeah, that, that, that's not, the that was the segue I was getting to. I was gonna say not All Stars, but that like Move no, PlayStation it, Move Heroes. Oh yeah. Oh. Wow, that's right. Shit. Not talking all stars. That's a that's an easy pick. Fuck. Who else was in that? Because I know it was I Jack. Think Sly. Yeah, that sounds about right. I mean, Sly was like the only other mascot character they had, quote unquote. That shit. Who is the game company behind Sly Cooper? Uh, I can't remember. It's the infamous people. Um, Sucker Punch, Inf I think. Sucker Punch. Yes. 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 Okay, because then it was. So it's Sucker Punch, Naughty Dog, and Insomnia. Those are the Sony guys. Well, Sony cartoon mascot, I like to say. Well, they they you say Sony cartoon mascot, and then, but then they Drake moved on up. to yeah. <laughs> nah, The Last of Us is a great cartoony game. <laughs> oh god, that would have been so fucking great. Who can remember everyone, every kooky kid's favorite Whoops. characters, like Ratchet and Clank and, and Clicker jo and, and Joel? And Joel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What's Daxter's character flaw? Eh, he's kind of arrogant and snarky. What's Joel's character flaw? Eh, he's not going to let this girl save a bunch of people because it might kill her and he loves her. <laughs> Joel lost a kid once and it's, it's really affected him. him. Really fucked with him a lot. God, I, I, I'm glad I finally beat that game. Like, before I saw anything on Last of Us 2. Oh, really? That nice. would spoil a shit ton of things. Cause yeah, it would have. All of the assumptions I made on that game were predicated on a certain character dying. Yes. And apparently that didn't happen. <laughs> See, when you say that out loud and I'm not putting the context to uh, The Last of Us, then I just go, oh, so The Last Guardian. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> Except no one dies in that game. Oh, or spoilers. I don't, I don't know anybody that's going to just go out there and play it right now. Yeah. Let's see, this well, is a that's way that what we I was planning on go. doing tonight, but oh, I guess. Oh, Grant, not. please. I do just own that game and never played it. Got it. <laughs> but obviously, if I. I bought, I bought it for like one Renegade for Life. Gotcha. Actually, I think I might have all the power cells by the end of this, but we'll still hunt around for Not them. Not the by episodes. all means. Yeah, because uh, this next one more. I'm about to get is really easy to get. I save before I fail. Um, and that is the amount that we need to get to the next area uh, in this game. Well, but hey, there's still some in the spider cave that I know will be kind of fun to hunt down for yeah, you. Man, so. Scooters. I mean, I guess I could turn this stream into trying to get us 100% of the orbs, but yeah. then I'd have to go to places that we haven't shown on the videos yet. And that breaks the illusion. Yeah. We need you guys to the, the assume immersion. this is as far as we've gotten, even though you're going to see our power cell. Wow, that is a pretty easy one to get. Yep. Uh, you'll see and our power cell number <laughs> be less than this in the next episode. Oh, gee, do you? The 100% speed run is about two hours long? Yes, but <laughs> have you met me? You you seem like a speed runner. You gotta go, you gotta go fast, Lanny. I know, it's why I'm charged with blue. Eat a dick. Oh, that, that, that's some good strats. 
Yeah, eating dicks is a very good strategy. This seems like a great place for the camera to be. Just like, just too low yeah, for you to see yeah. stuff. I mean, I get that the thing's filling up with purple goop, so... You want to know where the purple goop is? They're trying to focus is. you on, hey, look, danger's coming, but... Oh, man. See, the last time I remember something like this being that janky was uh, when I played Mickey Mania on the Saturn. And, oh, you had, boy. and you had to go up the fucking tower as it was on fire. And, oh, God, the nightmares I had trying to get to that fucking stage. Which, apparently, people tell me that uh, Mickey Mania is, like, super fucking hard. Huh. Really? And, like, and I never owned a Saturn, so I wouldn't really know. It was on a couple of other systems, but, like, Mickey Mania was, like, one of those, like, this game is fuck you in the face hard. Woo! Well, there's two orbs right there. You missed them. W what happened to that 100% run? I thought you were pro. You don't need the orbs to get 100%. Says you. There's probably a PB. <laughs> there. But yeah, that one offers you two orbs. Just oh, for wow. running the obstacle course and starting and the obstacle getting course. Getting away. Yeah, yeah, but you're still just... <laughs> Power cells. Fine. I'll stop calling them orbs, even though that's. There you They're go. more orby than the eggs. Yeah. Yeah, really. <laughs> Good jump, Jack. <laughs> that means every collectible. God, if we were playing fucking... Uh, yeah, no, I'm not a completionist. Fuck if, off. If, if we were playing fucking... What the hell is that game? Uh, Donkey Kong 64? We would be here for eons. Oh my god, that'd be a fucking flighted. nightmare. Oh, like, I, I... I was about to do that. I gave up on that fucking game. I didn't give up. I gave up on finding everything. I just scraped away with the bare minimum. I I know I beat the game, and then I tried to do a 100% run, and then I can't remember what banana it was exactly. I want to say it was there was some stage called like something the something galleon, and it was a banana you had to get with tiny, oh, and I just lies. could not fucking do it. Oh, we got that good. And I just remember yelling. This is one of the first times I swore as a kid. Just threw my 64 controller and just went, fuck you, Tiny. And then just like, <laughs> in out of context. And just walked out. Just imagine little upset Grant. <laughs> yeah, just like a little, it was probably like 10 or 11 oh, or shit. something. Mr. Oh, well, Kurt, it cuss words are bad. That was a speed run strat. Hurt boxing. Yeah. <laughs> you, you gotta die and it gets to the beginning. I didn't even have to climb anywhere. You don't, you, you don't have to impress me. I'm not you impressing. You have to impress them. Clearly, I'm not impressing you, Zito. <laughs> so why bother? Because I don't give a shit. Yeah. Like I said, you don't gotta impress me. You gotta impress Grant and them. Grant, am I impressing you? Oh, what a question! <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're, you're doing better than I could. Oh, what, a, what a neutral response. You know what? I'll take it. <laughs> Just from watching this, it is clear you have more experience with this video game than I do. Yes. Ah, can you... My, can I get the blue rings? I was going to say, what can, you, were about can to you, ask? you do the blue rings? Get the blue spheres. Let's see. Because I saw comments, people going like, we won't blame you if you give up on this one. It sucks even if you're good. Oh, well, now you've just been issued the challenge because that's just passive aggressive enough to make you have to fucking get everything. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah. Off to Way a, to Switzerland, Grant. <laughs> off, to a, off to a great start. Off to a great start here. Oh. Oh. Wow, that looks like your hitboxes are completely wide. They like, are very wide. Un un unabashedly wide. Unfashionably. Oh man. No, that's that's the fucking onion knight outfit from Dark Souls. Ah, alright. Fashionable. Let's do it! I'm gonna get some kind of hate for saying that. <laughs> alright. The one I usually miss is the one off this rock, so we'll see. Ah, oh, this one. Wee got it. Cool. Oh shit, it went around that way, that's right. I'm fine. I'm not fine. Oh, you're, oh yeah. Uh, you're no, ah, no. I avoided God's tuba! Don't, don't apologize, it's, it's, hit, it's hurt boxing. 
That's when you go to a boxing match after a previous boxing match. It's just hurt boxing. Yeah. Speaking of which, the McGregor Mayweather oh, fight that's was right. actually a lot better than I thought it was going was to it? be. Yeah. Like, I, I'm talking I, about it. I have to watch shit. it. Ah, fuck! Yeah, I saw people mention damn it, it over no, the Damn it. No, lost it. It's that damn box. Wow. I'm going to blow up these boxes real quick. Sorry, wow. God. I didn't mean to interrupt your tuba practice. Saw a couple of bit drops there. Who yes. we got, Grant? Ahem. We have uh, Number Hunter threw us 500 bits asking, Lanny, what's your favorite Ratchet and Clank? Uh, up your arsenal. I believe that's the third one. Crazy. A classic. Uh, Laserface throws us 100 bits saying, just wanted to say what's up, guys. Been watching your streams on TFS Gaming and just now getting to watch live. So here's 100 bits. Yo, what up? Welcome. Haha, <laughs> stayed up. Alright, not sure what happened there. I'm just gonna blame my uh, stupid fingers. Cowardly Brave at uh, throws his 500 bits saying, First ever subscription uh, subscribed stream. Uh, I love your guys' work and I have a question for you. Ha have any of you uh, have any of you played Xenoblade, Cro Xenoblade Chronicles? I know I Kieran have. has. Okay, well, yeah. Zeno has. I hear it's good. I hear it's really good. I, I started the 3DS one or whatever for like a little bit and just couldn't get into it. If you're okay with the game getting, like, if, if you're in it for the story, then you'll enjoy the game. But if you're in it for the gameplay, you're going to fucking lose focus midway. Mm. So you better get attached to that story or else you're fucked. All right. Like, I hear it's part of the Xenogears franchise, so. It is. You get Which to drive a around a mech that. in your... In a sense, yeah. You get to, well. I, I, again, I can't talk about it. Spoilers. If you're gonna, ah, okay. Are, are, you, are you gonna play it? Maybe. You, you have you have to give me a definitive yes or no for me to start talking about it. Kira FG has resubscribed for three months. Hey TFS, important question: uh, best anime and best game waifu. Best anime. Uh, I don't know if they mean best anime and best game waifu. So like our two best waifus from anime and video game. Or best Ooh. anime, and an unrelated note, best waifu from a video game. Uh, mm. the, the problem with that for oh, me shit. is, I normally will like the, I will normally like playing or watching the show, but I will normally never like playing the video game of said show. Okay. So I'm unfortunately like half baked <laughs> on that. Mm. I'm trying oh, shit, to think best one. game waifu. Yeah. You know what's and thing? complete. Hey, where'd it go? You know what would really suck if they didn't give you fucking like hints as to which direction you're supposed to go? Oh, wait, they don't. <laughs> they kind of do. The uh, the friggin' spheres are like angled a certain way, so it's vague. That Yeah, but if it's too, like, that looked like it was unabashedly vague. Sometimes it can be. Like the one where uh, you're coming around. Okay, Yami Florence with 500 bits. Hey, Couch, any plans to play Monster Hunter Stories? I've been playing the demo on the 3DS version. No, but Monster Hunter World, though, I will kill a man to play that on stream one day. All right. <laughs> we'll bring uh, in a man for you to kill. All right, uh, but yeah, there's, like, one where you're coming around here, and it's kind of angled to the left. And if you're not privy, like, if you're not privy, you don't realize to go that way. You, like, kind of skip it. You go through it here, and the next ring is, like, right like, you, you saw me miss it. I had to, like, drive yeah, around this thing but, a little. But for the average player, that feels like it's a little unforgiving. A little. Like, I mean, you, you just... Design-wise, I, I, I it's, guess... It's, they, a, it's a little trial and error. Right, but after a while, when trial and error starts becoming, like, way too much error in then trial, then, then you, like, start losing your audience a little bit. I guess. I don't know. I Like, I, again, I played this when I was a kid. It's very forgiving of... Like, you have a lot of time to play games. So. Right. Uh, let's see if I can get learn those things. Now. Uh, Nico Chan 99 throws his 100 bits saying, Is there any chance we can have the tuba on the soundboard? Mwah, mwah. I do like that sound, but that? I don't know. Ick. Whoop. Just gotta cut the right corners for this one. Uh, he's bobbing and weaving. Is Mark a diaper? I th we think so. It's either there. It's like a sumo thing. Something like that. Uh, sort of dead threat. Fred throws his 500 bits saying, Hey, Zito, did your computer end up exploding last night? 
Oh, because, uh, my, my stream last night, I, uh... Gotcha, bitch! Nice! I made this joke that since I was getting the computer today, that my old one was so ancient that we may as well play something that's, like, so heavy on it. So I played Battle Beast Simulator. Oh, I, geez. You just, like, loaded it up? I, I loaded it up, and I actually played it off, and the computer crashed. <laughs> Great! But, no, I, I watched the VODs of it, and I'm just... And I watched the VODs of that, and then I also played a little bit of Skyrim with a shitload of mods, and, oh, boy, it looks unplayable. Yeah, I popped in a little bit when you were doing that, when you are playing with your little kobold. Yes, uh, and oh god, I look at the playback and there's a lot of spots where it just like starts like dropping to like two frames. I'm like, yeah, I'm, I'm glad I'm getting this upgrade. <laughs> it, it took a decade, but I'm finally getting some. I'm now entering the 21st Shit. century. Tried to trick him, but he's yeah. taking none of it. Don't forget to tell Zio this is the intermediate, uh, intermediate, the intermediate ring, not the beginner. Wow. Okay. Oh yeah, we had, we had done another race before that with purple. Yeah, I don't think circles. there's an, I don't think there's another ring puzzle. I'm pretty sure yeah. this is just killing all the flying lurkers, which I don't know the trick to some of these. A lot of people said it's just chase them, and you're faster than them naturally, so you'll catch up eventually. Trying to out route them. I guess. Actually makes it harder for you. Huh. All right, well, let's see. We're getting a lot of, uh, <clears throat> a lot of 100 bits, a yes. lot of questions. A lot of hundos. A lot of hundos, but we're, uh, let's see. It's zip by. Yeah, they, they kind of do zip by, unfortunately. Uh, we got Crimson5106. Uh, hey, guys, I've been watching Game of Thrones. Have any of you been watching? I have, but I've read the book, so it's not like anything you tell me is going to be like, <gasps> Gotcha, bitch! There we go. So if you guys want to talk spoilers, you're more than welcome to. Grant has not. I have not watched it. No. Okay. Yeah, I then. do want to eventually. All right. Kaiser, uh, Ben, and I watched the season finale last night. It's good. Like, this entire season has been oddly paced, but I don't mind it. Yeah, this is my Zoomer now. Got it. I own this joint. This is my Zoomer. There are many others like it, but this one is mine. Mine is better than yours. Uh, Why do we, like, sub into Red this Yami Peter Florence's. Griffin state when we do um, that? I don't know. Thrar throws us 200 bits saying, Hey, guys, been watching you guys for a while, and I love you all. Grant, your jokes bring me incredible amounts of joy. Aww. Aww. You should see him when he plays Yu-Gi-Oh games. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thrar also throws us 300 bits. Have you guys played Dragon Ball Z Legendary Super Warriors for the Game Boy Color? It's a card-based DPZ fighter, and if you haven't played it, I am willing to send you mine since I've had it for 16 years and still haven't beat it. Cheers. Uh, Sounds I, difficult. I have played and beaten it. Uh, I really like that game because you can eventually, once you do a regular playthrough, you unlock all the characters, so you can have, like, Kid Buu fighting Raditz when he first lands. That's kind of cool. Like, yeah. Neat. Wow, so it covers the entire series. That's yes, pretty... it goes all the way through Z. That must have been really confusing in the Game Boy days when you're playing that and, like, you know, you just, like, the Saiyan, like, the uh, Frieza saga just came out or something. Uh, it was Game Boy Color, so I think by then... It was still Frieza, man. Cell took forever. Because I feel like I knew... Maybe I was just a well-read kid and just knew what was going to happen. But I, I remember getting Kid Boo and being like, I know who you are. Well, to be fair, back then when, like, things that we're able to read now as adults, as a kid, we were just like, I must be some kind of sorcerer! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> also very possible. <laughs> I'm a genius. Why ain't I writing for Dragon Ballies? Look, Zero and then he goes Super Saiyan 5. Uh, yes, of course. Zro gives us 100 bits saying, Today I learned why the sky is blue and clouds are white. Seriously. Or, no, really. Cool. But then he doesn't well, why, though? <laughs> doesn't give us an answer. I feel misled. Yeah, I need I need to I need to know. We've been jaded. Nutbox also throws us under bits saying, So Zito, is the gym with uh, is the gym with is Grumpy Witch to be included on Wednesday? Oh, okay. So I guess that might have a little bit of uh, context. Uh when, the view when I was in Taka stream, I was talking with uh Cranky Construct and him about our game dev horror stories. And, right. Uh, we were talking about this one game that went through development hell, and there was still a playable demo of it called Grumpy Witch. And mm. oh boy, 
Oh boy, it's it's a fucking it's a good time, and by good time I mean I can see why there was development hell. <laughs> Makes sense why it would stop. Uh, as for playing it on Wednesday, I don't know. Oh, yeah, I mean it would be something you'd bring in for charity or something. Mm. Well, like, Since that's the charity stream this week. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, but the, and also. I, I may do that, but at the same time, I was like, you know, I really wanted to fucking play Absolver. Mm. Really wanted to play Absolver. I know that feeling. And, and nobody would blame you. Not with Absolver specifically, but I get that feeling. <clears throat> now, we're sitting here just waiting for the fighters beta and hoping that we get into it. Yeah, right. Crimson says it's another 100 bit saying, hey, I started watching Gundam Unicorn, which is my favorite. Do you guys have a favorite? I assume he means Gundam. Uh, G, because that's I was the only say, one G I will Gundam's watch. Gundam's real, real, real good. Double uh, O eighty, I think it is. War in the pocket. I enjoyed Eighth Ma MS Team. I think that was the first one that I really enjoyed. That's the one where like it's the uh, Zaku Patrol, right? Yes, I believe so. Kieran is much more the Gundam expert than I. Oh yeah. Well, he's not here right now, so I have to yes. defer to you, who rooms with him and therefore gets information yeah. by osmosis. Yeah, I was gonna say it kind of just rubs off. You, you listen to the man play verses. I try to get the flies with, on this. Which, route which, here. To be fair, I actually would not mind giving that game a try. I know nothing about Gundam except for G, but <laughs> just which is the which is like if I had to choose a different Gundam. That's the best Gundam. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, Laserface with 100 bits saying, Question for the couch. Did you guys hear about Batman becoming a meta-human in the comics? What? No, if I did so, not. what are your thoughts? It's about damn time, I guess. I mean, isn't he already, like, yeah, yeah. a He seems relatively beyond. indestructible. Uh, isn't he already, like, a superhuman genius with his planning? Like, isn't that... No, he's not a genius. Power? He's just fucking paranoid, and that's what keeps him alive. He's just manically paranoid about Yeah, he's everything. a paranoid schizophrenic. Yeah, he's got contingencies for everything. Who's incredibly rich. His power level, his, his superpower is money. We his wa his, his wallet, power level? Yeah, his power wallet level, level is, is maximum. <laughs> I can't remember, is he more, ri is he richer than Lex Luthor or is like, are they like no, up he is. there? Yeah, no, I, I think they're like, I think they're averaged out in the universe because like, then you have to start getting into the whole situation of like Wayne Tech versus Lex Corp. Like, what, right. are their, what are their business plans and what what do they deal with? If you wanted to say that if anyone had to be richer, I guess it'd be Lex because he deals with more nefarious backhanded stuff. Yeah, Lex himself probably has more money, but it's like Wayne Enterprises makes more. Money. Yes, makes sense. Yeah, probably the, a more the, diverse the, portfolio. Yeah, the the revenue coming in for uh, Wayne Tech is a lot better, whereas the capital is way better in that sport. Well, then you have all those like back channel expenses in Wayne Tech, where it's like, why do we have seven tanks and three planes? Or or my my fucking favorite one ever. It was Bruce. Why do we, oh, we like young? And this is young Bruce. Young Bruce. Why do we need a machine that captures solar radiation to power the city? Don't worry about it. Because Dracula's gonna show up. Look, I need to fight Dracula, okay? <laughs> I need to prove I'm the bat. Cubic John throws his five bits saying, the internet sure has changed a lot. Right now, Penny Arcade is streaming and only getting 80 viewers while you guys are getting 1,500. God damn. Take that, Penny Arcade. <laughs> Don't say <laughs> What are they gonna do? Kick talk out of packs. Go ahead and try. <laughs> I dare you. No, try. Uh, one of these days. That's the one con I've always wanted to go to, but never have gone. I always, oh, you've never been to a pack? I never have been to a pack, and one of these fucking days before I die, that even, has to be something I do. Even I've been to pack. Um, Arkjin throws his 500 bits, saying, Hey guys, just wanted to give you these bits for the amazing work you do. Keep it up. Also, anyone there play Ace Combat? And if so, are you excited for Ace Combat 7? That's the fighter jet game, yes. right? Yes. I played it when I played the original one on PS2. I remember enjoying it, but not enough to stick around for the sequels. There was one that came out on PS3 that when I worked at a game store, we had for like $2 or something. 
so I picked it up. It seemed okay. The only game that I played close to a flight sim was, I guess, it, then this is not even fucking close. Star Fox, but hey! then, also there's this game I'm playing it's called Ace of Seafood, which is it's a flight sim, but you're playing as a realistic fish with anime lasers. Right. Sounds like a winner. I th actually, I think I've walked by seeing you play that a few times. That that's something I actually want to do for one of my streams too. I want to I want to put uh, anime show off Ace of Seafood. Yeah, show off Ace of Seafood and my 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 elite squad of salmon with their leader Anus McGillicuddy. Sounds what a like name. A Blair McCain throws us 321 bits, saying, I've been really loving seeing you play through this game. It made me go back and do a 100% playthrough the other day. Grant, have you heard of the crazy spike in difficulty between this game and the sequel? And what are your thoughts on the matter? I did not hear about that. Thank you for the warning. The only spike in difficulty comes from the fact that you have the same amount of health and enemies are far more projectile based. Uh, okay. And the fact that the driving missions are nuts. As in, like, Ballsack. I see. Thoughts on the new DuckTales show? It's a really nice, uh, they started off really nice with the reboot, and they're, they're getting super into the Karl Barks law of Duckburg and everything, and I'm absolutely in love with that, that they actually proved that they went back to the source material and actually are playing with it. Like, when Webby starts going, like, yeah, like, uh, Donald Duck's, like, like, on Hortense's side, twice removed, I'm like, holy shit, you read the books? <laughs> You paid that much attention. You paid that much attention that you brought up hordes? Yeah, I saw the pilot and really liked it. That's all I've seen. What time we got, actually? We are, it is almost four. Grant, I've collected seven power cells in an hour. <laughs> I don't, I yes, can't, I and? I can't that. Is that bad or good? Well, just, uh, just in comparison. I've been playing for how many hours, and I have like forty songs. Yeah. I mean, if each if each video. Then again, I also knew exactly where all of them yeah. were. So. If each, you know, video is only twenty or so minutes, so let's say three of them to an hour, that's, you know, forty some in about ten hours, something like that. Wow, you guys sound like you're in for the long haul. See, I'm trying to think of other ones that I, I guess I can go back to Misty Island. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, we haven't brought 90 orbs to the gambler here. That's ah. odd. I, thought I feel like that's something we definitely would have done. Yeah, I could have sworn we did. To be fair, he has a gambler. He doesn't need any more. Maybe he had another power cell that we, like, maybe we did, but then, like, there's another one he could give us. Actually, we probably only talked to him because of uh, the uh, racetrack, and then we forgot to talk to him again. Because we did his little circuit loop and beat his record, and he was like, Oh, yeah, you made me money. Here, have a power cell. Oh, that dude. Yeah, the dude that has no torso in his barrel. Like, seriously, if you, if you find an angle to look down the barrel, he has no legs. Mm -hmm. Well, <laughs> oh, yeah. He threw to help me win my way back out of this barrel. The power cell I Naruto Martin throws us 100 bits, saying, I hope to see you guys again, as I did a few years ago in Atlanta. Uh, I really want to meet Kieran. He has been super supportive with my issues lately and has been one of the best friends I've ever had. I love you guys. Aw, thanks so much, man. Thank you very much. Tortilla Lady with 100 bits saying, Is anyone interested in Battle Chasers Night War? I have never heard of it. Never heard never of heard it. Of, wow, if you've never heard of it, then... It must be very obscure. Yeah, because you hear of everything. It sounds cool, though. Yeah, there's me perched on my. That there's me, the vulture perched on the indie on the indie cliff side. Mm -hmm. Ah, a Crimson fresh corpse to bring forth. Crimson throws us another hundred bits, Jesus. saying, "Hey guys, I pre-ordered Dot Hack to you uh, last recode. Have any of you guys played Dot Hack games or seen the anime?" Kieran loves the Dot Hack games. I have played half of the first one, I think. I've played the first two, and I've not seen any of the anim animus. All right, there's a few I've, scout flies here I, that I, I missed. I saw a couple of the an I saw the first anime, and then there was the one where it was the the protagonists say their names like at least 50 times per episode. The Shugo and Reina. Sound, sound well, what about Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite? <laughs> Captain America. <laughs> strong man. I love having Hulk on my. Did you say strong bad? Strong, strong man. man. 
just when Hulk shouts out different characters, not names. Oh man, I can't. I'm gonna miss Okami because all he does is Doggy. Doggy. <laughs> well, there's DLC, but you know, <laughs> who it, knows? It takes DLC to get like a fucking at least good roster into the game. Yeah. Which, huh? You all got fucking bruised. I'm glad Mike Hagar's in it, but fuck it. I'm just waiting on fighters. I, I'm glad Jet is in it, but it's like, yeah, but do you guys remember that there's, like, Darkstalkers is that series where it's like they always call back to it, but they when it comes time to say, what about if we made a fourth game? What the fuck's a Darkstalker? What's a Darkstalker? Oh, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's only the fucking, like, next to what they're doing for uh, Resident Evil, not Resident Evil, next to what they're doing for Street Fighter V, Darkstalkers is their biggest waifu material <laughs> bullshit series ever. And I can't believe there's not capitalizing on it. They can I mean, Morrigan, so man. Uh, their whole roster is nothing but Monster Girl waifus. That's money! It is now. Laserface throws us 200 bits, saying, Last question for the couch for me. Who will be in your team in Fighter Z? I'm thinking Krillin, Piccolo, and Vegeta. I want to wait till the full roster's out. Yeah, I need to know. I need to see the full roster, and I need to see how each of them play. Well, of of the people who have been announced, who of would you say? The people who have been for announced? me right now, it is Android 18, uh, Gohan, and uh, Trunks. Uh, see, I want to. If, if no more characters were announced, those would be the. the I, I wish I they would like the play time. upon more of the zoner stuff because I haven't actually been like paying that close of an attention as I should be. But I know Krillin's in there because I like me zoning and then having a character who can shotgun blast his way into the front line. So I don't know if that's going to be like... Uh, tr uh, Trunks is your initiator. Yeah, trun like Trunks, Krillin, and then I guess I'm going to have to pick someone else. Because, see, if I could reenact like the team I had for Marvel vs. Capcom is. 2, then I would get in on that, which was... Uh, yeah. Cable, Spider-Man, and, uh, Hayabusa. Okay. Yeah, I'd need to play around a bit more. Like, with the demo that we played, I was really digging, uh, Vegeta, Frieza, Cell. Mm hmm But, from what I've seen, 16 is a lot of fun, because he's a grappler. Yeah, 16 looks cool as a grappler. Let's see. All right, that's all of them in Sandover Village. Sentinel Beach. Forbidden Jungle, I'm missing Piccolo the is a zoner with his cot with his key blast. Okay. He also has teleports, which is kinda cool. Yeah, I, I guess I don't know. Cause I like the idea of playing as a zoner character, but then again I also remember that my it is bigger than my ego, so I will always jump in for the frontline attack. Griffman1293 uh, has resubscribed for five months. Thank you guys for hours of amazing content. I'm going to basically be stuck in the house with a broken ankle and fractured wrist. Ugh, and I know you ah. guys will keep my spirit up. Thanks again. Well, we hope you feel better, man. Yeah, that definitely. that Fast sounds rough. Better, Fast dude. recovery. Dur I'm a dirty cable player. Well, I guess. Sure. Dirty cable player. Yeah, I'm a dirty cable player. Okay. Okay, you you tell me you tell me how it is when you walk in with Sentinel, asshole. Hyper Viper laser, so cool. Uh, Alan Bros with 500 bits, uh, saying, "Hey guys, love your work. I was wondering if there is any kind of chance of going back and continuing the adventures of Willy Samurai and Neo. Probably not. I don't think any of us really had any we... ton of affection for that game. Like it was fun, but it was fun, but it really <laughs> felt like it was just waiting for Dark Souls DLC. Yeah, like it, it was a very like." Or you could just wait for that. I work. think there, I think there was too much loot in it. That was my like one of my big issues. Yeah, a lot of the weapons were the same. Like that's one of my favorite things about Bloodborne, Franklin. I know every time we talk about something Soulsborne, like I bring up how Bloodborne is superior, but damn it, Bloodborne got hey, it right man. with like the amount of weapons you can't they had. Help it was how beautiful. much you love a game. If... Oh man, people can't do. You, you sound like me when I talk about Dead Cells. Dead Cells is really fun. I love Dead Cells. Like, Dead Cells right now is my favorite roguelike. I've been trying to get into, uh, ever since it became, Got uh, it. it came out of its, uh, what the hell is it called? It's, uh, beta phase, uh, 20XX. I can see why people are getting into it. It's a really, really, it's a really, really good Mega Man game that's also a roguelike in, a, in its own right, which is very nice. I'm waiting for a few more updates for that, because, uh, after Kieran brought it in for a cash fry, 
Uh, I play. I, I went home and I got it, and I beat it that weekend. Like I made it through a run. Oh, the the one. Yeah. yeah. I know what you're talking about. And so since then, I've just been like, I'm gonna wait for a few more updates. I want to see what new shit they have that comes out with it. Yeah, I, I wanted to see what they did when they uh, got it out of beta phase. And a lot of it looks like it's just a lot of performance and like quality of life things that they fixed, which is really good because I can tell the difference in the meta that it's not as cripplingly stupid as it was beforehand. Right. Uh, Malicious Destin throws his 100 bit saying, I got the game for Taka, but are any of you guys planning on getting uh, giving Destiny 2 a chance? Uh, I have it on I, I have it on Blizzard's thing, so I'm probably gonna play the beta actually starting tomorrow on my own stream. Oh, just they're a actually gonna bit. put it. They're actually gonna put it on uh, their Blizzard app or no? Yeah, it's on Blizzard app. Oh, okay. I I'm not gonna lie. I have actually been interested in giving it a try, but I don't know if giving it a try means I have to make a commitment to it. I wasn't that, crazy about the first one. So yeah, I was. I was go. not. I was not huge on Destiny One, but I hear there's. Some improve. Like, here's the thing. I also wasn't huge on Halo One, and Halo Two was a, That's a, fair. a, a except for story-wise, a huge improvement. Yes. Halo Three and Halo Reach were probably the best that series ever got, but I uh, forgot Four existed. Honestly, it. I feel was like okay. Did. The Brawl Bro throws 110 bits. Saying, hey guys, are you looking forward to the Fist of the North Star game that has been announced? Though the Yakuza that's right, one? The, yeah, the one by the people who do Yakuza. Which Ooh, that sounds fun. So, it, sounds like a match made in heaven. So I, I think it'll be real good. I don't know. Like for some reason, a lot of uh, a lot of Fist of the North Star games really irk me. Like they feel like they they start off good, but then immediately just drop off, and then it's just meandering until the end. Because then you're just playing a fucking game of a book you've read a million times beforehand. <laughs> I guess. Like how? I'd, I'd love a good Berserk game, but you know, I guess we have <laughs> we have Dark Souls. I was about to say that, to that's one that. of the reasons why I don't really like uh, a lot of anime games because it's like, what's going to be different from the manga or what's going to be different from the source material? Almost absolutely nothing because the safe route is just to go with what's already been established. That's why I like a lot of games that have like what if scenarios and. Mm -hmm. With their properties, where they experiment. With yes, that's fine too. But unfortunately, you have to admit a lot of anime games don't do that. Oh, absolutely. Speaking of anime games that don't do that, uh, Naruto Martin throws his five bits, saying, "I haven't asked a question to Lanny for a while." Uh, what up, Naruto Martin? Do you think fighters will be better than Budokai Three or not as good? What things do you think will be better or not received so well? What I have played of it, I feel like it's. I feel like it's going to be better than Budokai 3. The things I feel like are not going to be received so well are the fact that it's an actual tournament fighter. Yeah. And the fact that, like, here's the thing. Almost all Dragon Ball games up until now have involved, like, oh, press forward and blank for this. Press up and blank for this to now do go. this super. Now and now you real. have to do, yeah, now you have to do combos and shit. Actual inputs. I'm not going to lie. I'm interested in that, but I also get the, I also get where you're coming from where it's like, Oh god, I actually have to like learn. I have to shit. learn. I have to learn. I have to learn a Jack? game. Jack? Jack? Uh, uh oh, oh. 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 Oh, I think I broke him. Oh no. Here comes there we go. I just here, had to spin attack. Here comes a special child. Jack was moonwalking there for a moment. I need to find the last couple of flies. I'm not sure where they are. Kurizu0389 has resubscribed via Prime for eight months. Eight months, fellas. Just four more four more months to go for the full year. What up, Kurisu? Thank you so much. Thank you, you very much. I'll find you, fly. Yeah, this is about right. Oh, yeah, this is good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're not supposed to be able to stand on that, so you're just kind of sliding and hopefully falling. Mm, boy. Garo Kiem throws a 65 bits. I'm going to say it's Garo Kilometer. Uh, here's a few tiny bits and a question for the couch. Since the stream is already called Jacking It on a Monday, uh, uh -huh. do you think we might be able to do some Jackbox at the end for maybe like 15 or 20 minutes? You know what? I don't see why not. I, I mean, I've, I've already gotten way more uh, power cells than I initially anticipated. I think I found the last flies, too. 
<laughs> well, aren't you great? I, I am pretty. I, I, I am pretty awesome. I was gonna play off the thing where it's like, oh, we're we're, we're jacking it today. Why don't we jack off into the Matrix? Oh. oh. <laughs> Speaking of jacking off, name me a of good love Matrix game. Five hundred bits. <laughs> Uh, saying, started watching you guys in middle school, uh, and I have to ask. In the first season of DBZA, during the Bug Planet, in the arms of an angel played while Napple was remembering the Bug Giant. That's, that's not really a uh, Actually, it was uh, Memories. Yes. By uh, Barbara Streisand. Uh, and that had to get cut. Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. Pepe Cucker 69 gives us 100 bits, saying, Hey, are you guys looking forward to the Shadow of the Colossus remake? Not really, because it's the same fucking video game. It's pretty. That being said, that game already looked pretty. It looking prettier? Not a bad thing. Not a bad thing. If you haven't played the game, then absolutely go for it. But yes, for like, someone who's played it already, and there's not going to be a lot of change to it other than the fact that it's going to look nice, there's no point. Yeah, as somebody who's beaten it twice, I don't necessarily need to beat it a third time. Like I uh, like the last time I rebought the game was when uh, PS3, the PS3 had... Uh, 3D. Oh yeah. In it. I was because I I am a sucker for. Fuck off, sir. I was about to say like, oh, but don't you want them gamer trophies? Nutbox 102 throwing the counterpoint. You guys say that you love uh, when games experiment with their license. Yet in all fairness, you played a non-canon Naruto game and it ended up on the wall. Yeah, but it had. Yeah, but they did it bad. <laughs> Yeah. We, we here's We're the thing. Not, it's not we, automatically a good game. Yeah, we didn't have a problem with the story. The game played like ass. We enjoyed the story. <laughs> if you pay attention to it, we actually kind of dug it. Guy was like part dragon or something. Yeah, it was people, you insane. gotta remember that like you're playing a video game. When if the video game doesn't work, then what's the fucking point? It, it, the, the video, the point of a video game needs to be an interactive experience that feels good and rewarding to the player for having to want to interact with this game. And if the player doesn't feel like they're having a good time interacting with the game, it might be subjective or it might be something wrong with the game. And if that's the case, nothing's gonna save it if you can't fucking play it. Yeah. All right. Can't be rescued. That's why I don't like visual novels. They're not games. The stories. Alan Bros throws a 65 bits saying, by the way, guys, are you, what are your opinions on Call of Duty going back to World War II this year? I think that's good. Honestly, it's weird to say that something that used to be so prevalent yeah, is now that fresh. Yeah, everywhere feels new. Like, like, back in the early 2000s, late 90s. Couldn't take a step without running, or like, a... slipping over a World War II shooter. Yeah. That being said, it's been a long time since there's been a World War II shooter. And you know what? I remember liking that genre. And this political climate, reminding people that Nazis might be villains. Seems Probably a good thing. Seems well, okay. that's, that's why I can't fucking wait for Wolfenstein 2. <laughs> yeah, New Colossus, baby. That game looks so good. I, like, when I booted up my, when I first booted up my own uh, Twitch streams, I started it off with a playthrough of The New Order. Because I fucking love that franchise. It was such a good time. To this day, it is still my favorite single-player first-person shooter. And I love that they're just they're taking what worked for the first game and just working upon it, making it better. Mm -hmm. Guys and Goomba just threw us twenty bits. Each of them an individual birthday cake uh, emoji oh, with the words "now." <laughs> Oh, birthday! There you go. That's what you get for 20 bits, Goomba. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, I misread that. Now was from the thing telling me when he sent it. That's oh. Like, you he don't not, fuck, you don't he did not make the now demand. You do not put words You do not fuck around mouth. with the birthday bullshit, Grant. My mistake. Some, some of us get triggered by that. And some of us enjoy when people get triggered by it. Mm, and some of them forget that they're like three inches away from them. Well, Nate Junk has thrown us 100 bits saying, Hey, Couch, what manga series do you recommend? Right now I'm reading Berserk and JoJo Archive. My hero. That's that's mine. Hunter Hunter. <laughs> what the fuck are these last fucking flies? It's just one. I'm missing one. Check out the One Punch Man manga if you haven't already. The original? Yes. Yes! <laughs> fuck you. 
people say that it took a second run around with a different artist to make it better. I say, clearly you don't like the true source <laughs> I was, material. I was gonna say, you've just lost sight of the true art. Uh, Blair McCain throws, McLean throws us 100 bits saying, a playthrough of Contradiction by the world's greatest detective is one of my favorite series on the channel. Other than Batman, are there any other plans for playing weird or wacky mystery games, i.e. something like Murdered Soul Suspect? Uh, we've talked about a couple games. No concrete plans yet, but some are in the making. Oh, wait. Oh, I thought I saw it. I did not. Hmm. Are there uh, things in this game that you can only get until after a certain point no. of unlocking abilities? Nah, not, not like that. Ain't no Metroidvania here. D4C Trice, have you guys thought about playing any Bleach games? There, what, there were, was a quite fun turn-based JRPG on the DS uh, where you name your gun and your Zanpakuto. That's cool. That but sounds I, neat. That's Why do they have a gun? I don't know. I don't remember ever liking Bleach, though. I was going to say, so, Bleach is one of those big anime blind spots for me. I've never really seen or done much with it, so I have never played any Bleach games. I enjoyed it up to, like, I think like everybody, I enjoyed it up to, like, Rescue Rukia. Like, it's once the, once, the Eisen, once Eisen was gone, it was like, eh. There's, there's like, there's, there's so many things going on that you can't focus on the fucking thing. It, that, that was like me with Gundam, but except instead of, uh, instead of having to focus on one series... The, the thing that you watched it on or when people talk to you about it, they're like, no, there's this Gundam and then this Gundam. No, you gotta worry about the political like agendas on this Gundam. Or you gotta worry about like why this person hates this person or why this person has an Oedipus complex. Where are the fucking robots killing each other? That's all we want. That's all we need to know. JJ Team Ruby threw us five bits saying, what's your favorite Fire Emblem game and character? My favorite game is Conquest and character is Camilla. Camilla. I can't imagine I, my son. I've played like three of them. I would be lying if I told you I remembered any character I, or I like playing what made Lord, the games different. <laughs> I like playing uh, the the one that was on the Wii. The, I think it was like the Dawn Lord. Brigade. Uh, new. Uh, no wait. My Dream favorite. Like I don't new. remember if it had a subtitle or not, but I believe my favorite was uh, the first one that they released on the Game Boy Advance, and my favorite was Lin. I liked Lin. That was with Roy, yeah? No. Oh, no, wait. Lynn was wrong. the protect. There yes. it is! Ro Roy How do was I get in a there? different one. Yeah. And I think uh, Hector. The one I'm thinking of is the one that allowed you to actually make your own units, which I sorely fucking miss in this franchise. Hmm. That was the one on the Wii. Like, I remember, like, my first playthrough, I got a chef that just fucking wrecked house early game. Mm hmm. And I, I, I got so fucking upset when she died. And I was just like, oh wow, I can see why people get into this franchise. And then, oops, I guess now we gotta worry about making our characters more vibrant, and so you can fuck them and have kids. No, I wanna make my own units! No, no, you no, need to you have gotta future have babies. babies. I don't give a fuck about predestined- Babies! I don't care about predestined determined babies! Romance Could that- Could you give me an Look, option? romance that 12, that, yeah. that- thousand-year-old nope. dragon that looks like a 12-year-old. Oh, You'll be fine. Or that girl Tiki. who's only 14, but you can romance her because it's in the future that you have a baby with her. Oh, so she'll God. Be, she'll be old she enough. She takes time. Changing their class does not mean you're shifting a huge dynamic of the character. It's still the same fucking kid. It's going to be great. This girl, she acts like she's all tough, but if you talk to her a lot, she's, she's actually, actually kind of vulnerable and needs there, a man. There is one fun thing, though. The dragon lady you guys are talking about, the one who looks like she's 12, but she's a thousand years old. Yeah. If you do end up having her kid into your party, you find out her kid's way more adult than she is. I know. And she rips into her for it. That was funny. 100 Blades from Nightblade 102. There is an indeed a special scene if you get all the power cells, so you might want to go for it. I don't think we are. Well, I definitely have all the power cells up till... Well, I have all the power cells for Misty Island. Let's see, what am I missing? Misty Island, Fire Canyon, Rock Village, got it. Precursor City, got it. Boggy Swamp, got it. Precursor Basin, got it. Mountain Pass, missing one. Now you gotta go to Mount Aragonus and kill the Quadricorn. Hmm. How are we missing that many in Volcanic Crater? I don't even remember that many in Volcanic Crater. There's a bunch, there's, there's must be a giant spot in Volcanic Crater that we just have not visited. Someone in the chat actually just made a very good point. Ah. I, can, I can see why Zito doesn't like uh, the newer Fire Emblems because you're mid-maxing characters. And speaking as someone who GM'd, mid-maxing fucking makes me absolutely livid. <laughs> right. 
Ooh, damn. Ooh. Introspective Spy dropping... 6,000 bits. 6,000 bits. Holy shit. Thank you, Introspective Spy. Can't wait to see you guys at San Japan. San Japan, consider these bits a round of drinks on me. Hell yeah, man. Wow. Looking forward to seeing you. That'll San Japan's always fun. Yeah. It'll be always time. a pot. It'll be my first time going. Uh, Vork88 throws 100 bits saying, TFS, will you donate for Red Cross in Houston? Uh, um, we have not decided which... We haven't uh, decided which charity, charity we'll, we'll be doing, but for those to. of you that are... Uh, that have come in a little late. On Wednesday, we will be doing a charity stream. Double be, length. Yeah, double the length of our normal stream. Uh, we'll be setting up a donation section to donate straight to the charity of our choice. Well, through us, but... Yes. Through us to the charity. Yeah, and then we will give it directly to the charity. We just like to know exactly how much we raise. Right. Underdog Zero throws us under bits saying, I just logged in and literally thought, wow, Grant's, Grant's gotten a lot better at this game. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> False. Woody, uh, Woody RTW says, with 100 bits, Zito, love your bargain bin streams. Picked up Downfall and Carrie's order up after watching them. That was, oh, God, I lost it. Seven something. That was $7 well spent. <laughs> I'm very glad that you see it that way because that was completely my intention <laughs> to bring games that you may have not have seen, even heard of, or looked over. And if you liked what you saw, you gave it a shot. And lo and behold, someone gave it a shot. Yeah. And See, I really like the idea of that show. It, it's it's showing people who might not have like the most money in the world for video games. Like, hey, look, there's still some stuff out there. Sure, some of this stuff is crappy. And yeah, Lanny doesn't get to buy as many Hearthstone cards at the end of the day. But you know what? It's it's for, for a good, good cause. cause. You can't you you can't have that second already. God just won't let. I you. already had the second you, one. No, Thank no, you. you can't get a third so you can get the gemstones. God won't Nero let you. I need the dust. Five bits, saying I've only got five bits to give. I'm hoping the package I sent uh, actually gets there on time. Grant care package from a fellow poor soul trapped in Ohio. I checked the mailbox on Friday, so I'll see if it got there then. Have, well, we'll have to check it earlier. Oh, that's uh, right. Because it's San Japan. San Nippon. Yes. So I'll have to check that earlier this week. Sorry, man. <laughs> uh, ReaperCast throws us a thousand bits saying, first time subscribed, been lazy, uh, and, and, here's my, and here's my bit virginity. It's somebody's birthday somewhere, Lanny. Just so Zito can die a little more inside. Just so Zito can die a little more inside. Oh, Happy birthday to somebody out there for however many bits we got. It is wonderful that you happen to have a birthday, Zito. Zito, what what is your birthday, Zito? Birthday thought, Zito. Zito, what's your thought on people's birthdays? Zito, everybody, everybody, happy birthday! I love you all. Holy shit, birthdays are amazing. That's my favorite part of the song. Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> Hope there's something good inside for me. Sorry, I kind of spaced out when things are terrible. What happened? Ah, there's Point this dragon through us 40 bits. He asks, hey, Couch, I really like the anime Soul Eater, but I don't really hear other people's opinions on it. Could you tell me what you think of it? I thought it was all right. I mean, uh, it's like the anime itself is over now, right? Uh, like, I, I, thought I, watched, I thought I watched through all of it, but I don't remember. Uh, I thought it was OK. I saw a couple was, episodes of it. Felt pretty generic. Like I like. Yeah, nothing. I think that that would be my number one complaint. But you like know what? Really I also think fairy tales a little generic. <laughs> fairy, fairy tale is super very generic. generic. Yeah. <laughs> fairy tale. But I, fairy tale was so generic I could. But I would like I would lean sense. towards uh, Soul Eater being the better show. Yes, I would agree. Yeah, so, Soul, Soul Eater, Eater has some cool concepts that are that I don't think are generic. But I feel like its characters all kind of ran together for me. And See, I think I like I think. Stuff just felt very slowly metered up. I liked the idea that people transformed into weapons. That's cool. That was fun. I need to figure out what that other power cell is here. There's a power cell that I just have not seen in this rat route. Because, yeah, it's just this blank spot here. We got all the flies, which means there's just a free-floating power cell sitting somewhere. You like the music of Fairy Tale? Are we talking about the fact that Real Big Fish did an opening for them? Are, we, are, are real big fish just massive weebs? I don't know. Or they just get paid okay. a lot of money. I, I think I, I guess they just got super paid. They're a ska band, so it's like I don't I don't know. They, they could be super huge weebs for the show. But oh, that that was for fairy tale, and I'm just like ah, I feel like they got paid to do this. And someone in the fucking uh, someone in the production team really liked real big fish. I feel like that's the only case scenario. That's for fair. It. 
Nutbox102 so throws his 100 bit vent. saying, Lanny, I watched your Hearthstone stream last night and I have already, uh, already spent 60 bucks on cards. Oh man, that's not my intention at all. <laughs> right, Karen, Karen just corrected me. He's absolutely right. It was the Rave Master opener for the American release. Oh really? Yeah, that, they got real big fish to do that opener. That's hilarious. And, I'm, and I feel like that was like a pay job. That wasn't like a, they did that because they liked the show job. But I'm glad you enjoyed my Hearthstone stream. I intend to actually do a little bit more today, actually, uh, after I fuck this up, after I get home, because uh, I do want to finish off beating the Lich King with every quest, or every class. So I'm probably going to do that some tonight. Everybody wants to check that out. Twitch.tv slash Lanny Fator. Whoa! Plugs, mister. The shill. I'm shill. I, I hardcore shill. Everybody, everybody on my stream knows that. I am the shilliest. The shilliest of billies. I think someone in the chat actually tried to like do something as well for that. I think they were like asking me like, why don't I do art streams for TFS? And I'm just like, uh... People you, will. Uh, I, I have a really huge sneaking suspicion that a lot of people will ask me to draw. Will, will pay me to draw stuff that I really don't want to draw. <laughs> draw pudding, naked. I mean, well, I, and that's I, the. I mean, I could do that, but that's gonna be like an obscene amount of money. <laughs> <laughs> It'll just be real expensive. It's going to be hyper expensive and not be televised on Twitch. I'll send it to you. <laughs> Ko2 generations throws 400 bits, saying, "Zito, take my bits and my love." Oh, and lips. All right, thank you. The, 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 oh, is it that? The birthday gag. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No. It's gotta be somewhere. You gotta grab me a drink more. You do that. The fact that this thing is eluding me is really upsetting. Someone says uh, you need to activate the yellow eco temple in Snowy Mountain. Oh, god damn it. Yeah, so there is something we need to do in order to do that. Shit. I don't want to go there because it's a place that we haven't been to we on the game yeah, yet. Yeah, we haven't, we haven't shown. Like, we've been there, but people haven't seen it yet. Yeah, they haven't seen that. And it's a place that you kind of skipped. It's, yeah, it's, 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 it's very easy. There. It's a very easy to miss. Omega Hawk throws five bits saying, uh, here, have some bits, guys. Just wanted to know, what are your thoughts on the Fate franchise? I've never seen any of them. Fate, Fate Stay Night, stay Fate night. XLR, yeah. whatever. Fate Proper Nouns. I think I watched like an, like a first episode of one, and then they had like five proper noun topics that were just nonsense that they were talking about over the course of the episode. And I was like, Nah, I'm out. <laughs> Sounds like an anime that's giving me homework. Yeah, I've never I've never seen it. Uh, I've never seen any of them either. This thing sounds evil. Should we trust it? <laughs> Why would you not trust Dr. Claw? Yeah, there is one thing. There is one thing. One thing that we missed. Well, well, well. I should have figured that as soon as I was trying to figure out that one vent that we weren't getting anything out of. Naruto Martin throws 15 more bits saying, These go to Lord Moonstone. Kieran, I don't have a whole lot of bits, but I want to share the love to Kieran. This Kieran, you just got some bits. Cool. Kieran, you're loved. He's getting water. He hears the love. All right, well. He doesn't hear it. Let's he see. feels it. So, like, when he's walking downstairs, all of a sudden he'll get a twinge and he's like, Oh! Woo! Love! So, let's see. I've gotten every orb that I can get up to this point. So. All right. What time we got? Is it 4.30? Uh, on the dot, according to my phone, yes. Oh, yeah. All right. 4.30 well, exactly. Let's see. Oh. Other video games? Going to have to change that uh, Elgato real quick. Just a sec. All right, then I will stay here and keep an eye on the dear nations. The stream froze? Doesn't have. Uh, well, that's probably for the one person. <sighs> Alp88 used 300 bits, saying, My first bit dropped before I moved to Denver. A birthday greeting for Ivan. 
Happy birthday, Ivan. Happy we birthday. played his song like five times. We're okay. It's not neat. No, 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 no. Oh, birthday is a doodly <laughs> You can't stop the birthday love. Thank you. Oh, I think uh, you might have to go in there and switch it to PS4. Just the Elgato's menu itself on there. You'll have to right click its source. Ah. Uh. Or not its source. Um, the gear by it, like the video input. Wait, hold on. This, this one? Here, I can do it. Okay. <sighs> Leave this to one with more experience. Tag. All right, El Gatter. Let's. This was an unexpected change, so give us a second, folk. Oh, yeah, all the space. Yeah, just kick that microphone. Yeah, Way to go, Zito. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm. Yeah, space. This whole couch is mine now. Happy birthday, Zito. Joke's on you, motherfuckers. My birthday's not till July. Hey -o. So it's like it practically just happened a month ago. Working on it. People saying Zito's jacking it is the ultimate. Yes. I'm, I'm jacking. I'm, I, right now, I'm jacking. Ja in he's jacking in, guys. I'm, I'm jacking in. I'm jacking in to the, to the Elgato. I have assumed control. <sighs> I'm I'm countering Lanny at every turn to make sure he doesn't actually get the screen right. Oh no! Ah, you're wor it's working so far. Why would you do such a thing? Mm, maybe he shouldn't play that birthday song over and over again. Did we? But people love it, Zito. I know, but I don't. Well, that's not my fucking problem. <laughs> there we go. I'll put us on full screen hey! while I try to figure this out. Go for it. Mm -hmm. Oh no! Mm -hmm. The illusion. Mm -hmm. People now know I have mm -hmm. legs. Boop. A thousand bits from Karizu saying, I've har harvested Zito's salt towards the birthday song into bits. It's only a thousand. Get you damn bits. That, My hate is giving us bits. So is the birthday song, Zito. Mm. But Sounds like the birthday song is actually doing more work on this one. Right. Well, no, you know. Also, everyone's surprised you have legs. I know. Well, I mean... Where the fuck did these even come from? Where did I get these? Also, I'm apparently the only one with shoes today. Accurate. I have to buy new pairs of shoes. That's the only reason I'm wearing sandals I, all the time. I think I need to buy new pairs of shoes because, like, the tread on the bottom of these is worn off almost completely. I, well, and my problem is, is that I've been wearing skaters, skater Kairos for, like, four years. So I think mm. they finally have, like, lost their purpose in life. Like, uh, like two years ago. Elgato changed something while I wasn't looking. I have no idea. I, I remember what go. you're talking Input about. Device, PS4. I wanted to wish Zito a, a happy late birthday. So those thousand bits, them's mine. All right. You, you can't touch those. Them's mine. A late happy birthday for the a Zito. Whole, a whole ten dollars for a singular beer at Buffalo Wild Wings. All for me. Wait, Zito's human? Yeah, I know. Disappointing, right? Well, now so it's just being denim. silly. <laughs> now it's just being mean. Yeah, it's just being rude to me now. Uh, when you switched there the Elgato, did you unplug it on both ends and I did. everything? Okay. I know, Give a... me the one moment, please, instead of no signal now. So that's Brax nice. Brax says, bitch, I'd kill for $10. My dude, I have things for you to draw, then. <laughs> I mean... Don't don't fucking say that shit and not expect me not to tell you you have to draw things for me now. Also, don't kill someone for ten dollars. There's plenty of other things you could do for ten dollars like that are way easier. Song. Yeah. <laughs> so you know you don't like how when you go to a, a fucking restaurant and there's always that team of people who like sing you a birthday song that's not the actual birthday song and it's off key and, and super awkward. Yes. That's the same feeling that arises in me whenever that fucking button is pressed. There was a Tim and Eric 10-year anniversary special well, on Zito, this you weekend. don't understand. I live to give people the feeling of living at a Joe's Crab Shack. <laughs> <laughs> I've never eaten there. 
I don't think I have either. I've always seen one, especially when I lived in San Francisco. There was always one by the piers, and I've always just never gone inside. PlayStation's on, right? Uh, Looks like it. It's green. Huh. It should be showing up by now, then. Zito hates birthdays. Well, I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll celebrate the fact that you lived because it's cool that if I know you and I like you and you lived, and that's radical. But here's ten dollars. Go buy something nice for yourself, I guess. I try unplugging it and replugging it in one more time, maybe. Lovely little technical difficulties. Here's an issue. What's that? There's no HDMI cord plugged into the PS4. That would do it. Oh. I wonder how that happened. I think you... Zito doesn't want us to... I didn't say that, dude. I well, said some, I wanted someone to is, it, it must have switched out for... Uh, oh, it's probably in that PC. That PC over there. No, it's plugged into the Wii U for... Uh, oh. Oh, Metal Gear. Right. That makes sense. Yo, Dende. With that four month rec uh Who is that? Booty Disciple. With that four-month uh, Twitch Prime resub. Haven't been able to catch a live stream in a while, but always give my Prime sub because I love you guys. Thank you so much. Zito, what were you doing while in San Francisco? College. Dola Bear dropping 600 bits. Zito, human? How dare. Ah! Are we getting anything now? Uh, it's still mm, black It's screen. got no signal now. No device now. One moment, please. Now. Ah, there we are. All right, we got we got screen footage. Now we're just waiting for it to kick in here. I was at college there too. Were you at that the Academy of Art? Yes, yes, I was actually. That was the college I went to. I went there when they first did their game design program. Oh boy, that was a mess. Alright, that should... I just deactivated and reactivated. We see it out here. Hey! I see it down there! Hey, buddy, we got it. Everywhere! Whoop. All good. It takes a village. Alright, let's see. What do we have on here? I'm not sure if we have Jackbox installed anymore, but we might still have user words. We have Scootals. Skeetons, please. Skeetons. Where's the Funimation? Oh, somebody has the Funimation app. It's not on the... 500 bits, 500 bits from Joel 55 digging the OSU shirt, Grant. Uh, I'll actually be graduating from there in December. They're going on to law school. Congrats. Right on. I had friends who went there. I never went there personally. All right, well, since it would take a while to install a Jackbox game... We can use and this is essentially the same thing. It's true. Let's play some user words together. Oh boy. Zito loves this game. I hate it. No, I don't. That's right. You, you don't guys hate played it. this game. <laughs> it's words something or it's words game dot law. Yeah, words game dot law. The party game for funny people and their unfunny right. friends. You on words That's game me! Lol? I'm the unfunny game friend! Wordsgame.lol We gotta make sure we're on should, here first we, so that yeah, we can... Yeah, hide the screen. Oh, we don't need to hide the screen. We just need to type yeah, it in before everybody else. There's enough delay. There should be enough delay that as long as we're all on there ready to type it, we should be good. Alright, I've been given the prompt to enter a four-letter code. You there? Yep. Alright, cool. All right, play, let's play game grab a web-enabled device like a smartphone, a tablet, or anything with a browser, and navigate to I'm a player. To I'm a player. Join, join game. game. LOL. Enter name. Then enter Zero. the room code. Done. All right, we safe. Woo! All right, we got it. Everybody hopped in just in time. Get ready. It's time to. Use your words. Use your words, everybody. Hooray! Glory of the silver screen. 
in the dumper. Shiki74 throws his 100 bits and wants to know what do we think about the character creation in the new Naruto game? You are about uh, to see yeah, Naruto Xenoverse. Could be fun. Is that really what and it is? Pretty much. Will Looks like it. By you. <gasps> Get ready. The clip will play twice. Mm -hmm. Now for our feature presentation. Let's see it. Clip again. Is that like supposed to be the sound of like glasses clinking or something? Yeah, I'm not sure what the sound is supposed to be. Call me Laddie too. Just subbed with Twitch Prime. Thank you so much. Call me Laddie. I like this game's aesthetic. It's very simple. It's fun. Do we have this on streamer mode? So, if, God forbid, we let's put this see up how you vote. Muted. It should be, yeah. All right, sweet. I mean, it, it, has, it didn't fucking stop, so it didn't stop the uh, shit to pop up on YouTube anyway. So whatever. Word. I got, Baba. A, got a couple points. For you got a, you got you got you got a vote. In fact, you got my vote. Yay! You got the my vote. Yeah! Is in your I'm hands, funny. But be careful. Sorry, it's, it's sticky. Let's play extra, extra. Get ready. 
ready? Here's what you came up with. <laughs> I won't. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> that feels like a house answer. Go, I was gonna say, no. going for a what reach your there. Favorite answer, but watch out for house answers. Cast thine Let's vote, Thrar. Voted, shall we? Thrar. And that was a house decoy. Oh, oh shit! Oh. No. Yes. Go Zito. I'm funny. Don't worry, Grant. Yeah. You made it back. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Nice. Well Farmers done. Predictary surplus. <laughs> well done. <laughs> Grant with that commanding lead. And now. The Turns out I can use my words blank. good. Yourself. It's blank o -matic. For those asking, yes, this game is called Use Your Words. A Jackbox-esque, although I've heard interviews with the developers. They're like, we don't like to just name drop our competition when describing our game. So it's been real hard to, to yeah, describe to, it. Yeah, to describe this game. <laughs> yeah. I believe this was uh, theorized by Brental Floss, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. At least I know he was a huge part in the development. That's a big part of it. Solid game. I think it has a few too many mo or a few too few modes or whatever. Yeah, I think there's that and there's just something about like I don't know if it's time showing off answers, but the uh, the what do you call it? Um Rapey Uncle Steve. He just keeps coming back and only you can prevent him. It's up to you. Only you can stop it. I figured someone was gonna go for that kind of like joke. Caught himself. Only you can prevent for how do you stop virginity? <laughs> You can end it, yeah, but you, well, can't, yeah, like, you can't prevent it. No. Well, okay, prevent is maybe the wrong word. Mm. This is a bad prompt. Yeah. I think we can all just agree on that one. Yeah. Whoever wins, we all Here's lose. how you voted. Thank you. I'll take some points, though. You're welcome. There you go, Zito. You prevented those STDs. Oh. Anal discharge. Very I, popular among the I crowd. Figured, Not in front anymore. I figured rapey Uncle Steve was going to get a billion points. The, it's it's the word prevent that stops that. Yours yeah. to ruin. It's sub the title. I think this is the best. This and the uh, uh, newspaper ones are the best ones. Yeah, I agree. It's tough.
Man, Hayes right on it, though. You've only got 30 seconds left. Oh, I so literally just came up with a really good one in my head and until only after I put it in my first I hate one. when that happens. Fuck. Yeah, and you can't Fuck. undo it. Shit. And okay. here's what you came up with. Hey. Hey. All right. Eh. Well, it's that, it's that look at the route. Well, uh, I guess not bald anymore. I think mine auto corrected on a word. That's Time to vote for your baby. It was a rough prompt. Yeah, he's kind of rough. Uh... Yeah, mine definitely auto-corrected through a few words. Oh, no. And I didn't notice until it was too late. I'll go with the safe answer. Fuck it. Here's how you voted. That was a house decoy. Hey! Ah. Poor Thrar. <laughs> yeah! There you go, Thrar. Hey, you got it back. Earn it back. I did not expect my uh, answer to actually do that. Coming out ahead! It's weird Good when luck. you don't know which right one's yours. Right yeah. Now, it's extra, extra. People saying, is this just kind of a bad Jackbox game? I would say it has a leg up on some of the Jackbox yes. stuff. Like, I certainly like some of this stuff better than Jackbox. I, I feel like it is a Jackbox game with, like, slightly less personality in the, like, host area. Yeah. But I think its prompts are more universally Some, some of it, yeah, its prompts are universally a bit better. It, while it may have, like, fewer games involved, I think it's still, like, better in some regards. Mm -hmm. Uh, also, their house answers actually stand a chance. Yes, they have they have a much better algorithm for fake answers. I feel. Here's what you wrote. And I do know a new Jackbox is coming. 
<laughs> God damn it. Baby boss. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty great. <laughs> Zounds. <laughs> That's all right. Vote for your favorite answer now. Whoa, what? That's not... Oh, okay. I have to vote with my heart. Um, I guess my dumb ham hands must have picked something different. Oh, because no. Because it's not what I typed. At all. Oh. I'm pretty sure I just gave you some points, Grant. I'm pretty sure you're the only one wow. to use that word. I actually had... <laughs> fuck! I actually had an answer, and my fucking dumb ham hand screwed it for me. That was a house decoy. Whew! I almost voted for it. Yeah! Is that yours? I'll, yeah. Yep, alright, yep. Yeah, titty industry booming. I'm glad we keep giving each other points. We're on a wavelength, and Grant. Now, for the latest in obsolete technology, it's blank o -matic. See where we go from here. Even though I have time, mine was a bit of a desperation answer. I was like, I can't think of anything. Just run with yeah, it. Yeah, pretty Let's much. See what you weirdos wrote. Right. Yeah. Topical. Got to make it political. Beef balls. I'd, I'd play it beatball. Or see a game. Midnight, Midnight Torment. torment. <laughs> Wario Stadium. Yo, that dude's got a bunch of coin. I bet he could make a hell of a good stadium. Somebody's saying Lanny cheating? What am I doing? How can you cheat? By being so funny. He writes for Dragon Ball Z Abridged. Clearly, I'm at an advantage. <laughs> Okay, vote for your favorite answer. Yeah. Here's how you voted. Yay. There you go, Zito. Oh, that was a house decoy. Really? Ah. Wow, they use proper nouns, huh? I mean, who's going to call them? Thank you. You're welcome, Grant. Oh, wow. Get ready for a 10K. Finale, the lightning round we call Survey Says. In Survey Says, all point values are doubled. You'll be shown three prompts in a row, and since Let's Play mode is turned on, you'll get 90 seconds apiece to answer each one. 90 yeah. seconds right. apiece. Prompt. You dirty bird. Think of a, bad, a bad name for a supper camp.
Ah, thought of a better name. Similar joke, but better wording. <laughs> Someone in the chat said a good one, but I'm not going to use it. <laughs> 15 <laughs> seconds left. Damn it. Five seconds on the clock. Person who's left. There you we got go. it, Silver. silver. Well, Damn, Grant with that commanding lead. Turns out I know how to use my words. So so it would seem. I'm not loving my answers I've had for these prompts, though, and since this round counts double... This I'm, could be my downfall. I'm kind of happy with what I'm writing. Final. It's just that I hope I didn't fucking Make press house one, answer again like an asshole. Fifteen seconds left. Get ready. Here's what you came up with. All right. Let's see what our prompts are. All right. <laughs> going for the going for the rhymes. All right. Crystal lock. Lilac. Lilac. Oh. <laughs> Two L's. <laughs> Uppy feeling. Hickory heinies and the pineys. Camp Feel feels it. well. <laughs> <laughs> Vote for your favorite answer now. Fuck. There are a couple all right ones there. Here's what you wrote. All right, next. Survey says, name something you wouldn't want your mom to find. The, the bodies. bodies. Fair enough. <laughs> the fact that it's a collection is what makes it alarming. Yeah. How could you? <laughs> the antidote. <laughs> that that's feels really like good. such a house answer, though. <laughs> that feels like house a house answer. answer. <laughs> Fair. Nice. Yeah, no, that'd be a little embarrassing for you. Yeah. <laughs> Vote for your favorite answer now. Although that also feels like a house answer. The, uh, her underwear one. It's a good house answer. Yeah, that's definitely a compliment for this game. It's house answers, answers have pretty consistently been like, oh, they went farther than I thought. 
A ravenous regret. Uh, that seems kind of harsh. If just the concept of regret. The delicate tickler. General <laughs> Russia. <laughs> <laughs> it's just disappointing because I hope they gave him more character. The fiendish <laughs> gas, gas passer. Dr. Hater Dabman. Oh, wow. I really just don't want to answer that one. He just hates dabbing. <laughs> Dr. Sorry. Sunshine. Why do so many villains have I a medical degree? Why do I fucking pick love... a winner? That just reminds me of that one... The, what was it? The Manatee Man from uh, Adventure Brothers. I have, I have a series of rare cuttlefish. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Give us the cuttlefish! No. I'm betting no one voted for any of my answers, and I voted for all the house answers. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Take me down a peg. Doctor Dugong. Yeah, that was the uh, that was the guy. I have a series of couple of things. All right. Let's, let's see. see. How you voted. Hey. Go Zito. I like that one. Now that was a house decoy. Ah. That was the worst house decoy I've seen. Yeah. Camp feels well. That that was as as soon as I as soon as I Aww. read it out loud sounded terrifying. Nobody liked Camp Grab a lot of you. I almost got went for it. <laughs> Zito, that was good. Everyone's getting points here. Hayes bringing it up. Holy shit. Hayes taking it. Didn't even get the fake answer that time. General Russia was real good. That was a good General one. Russia was very good. Oh, nice. Didn't expect the delicate tickler to take it so high. Oh, well, you never do. At least I'm not dead last. That's the thing about that delicate Not dead last. Woo! You all right, King go Grant. The but wait, there's Baker trophies to be handed out. The funniest player. You receive the Golden Joker Award. Nice. Thank you, audience. You all know what's up. The, the grossest bird. player. You receive the Dirty Bird Trophy. You dirty bird. Dirty you. bird. The spectators have also named the most offensive player. You receive yeah, the Golden Joker Yeah, motherfucker. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> and thanks for playing. You your words. I don't even think I really had particularly <laughs> defensive answers. Laughs. Well, apparently you did. Thank you for joining us for the casual Monday stream, everybody. Woo! It's been a good time. Like I said, I'll be on playing some Hearthstone later if you want to join me. Uh, anybody else going to be doing shit later? Yeah, I'm going to be Today, doing probably not. If my, uh, compu after I set up my after you get your new computer? That would yeah. be cool. Anyway, yeah. Good, good stuff. stuff. Good stuff, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow. I'll be on there taking on Ben and Tuesday him. Woo! And on Wednesday, don't forget to stop by for our double long stream where we are going to be raising some money to help uh, help out the people hit by Hurricane Harvey. Yes. Thank you so much. Make sure to donate when you, uh, if and when you can to the charities. Help everybody out. Have a good one, everybody. Be good to each other. Later, everybody. Later.